Hi, this is Larry for Vanderbilly.com. Today we're looking at REM's The One I Love. REM was an alternative rock band in the 80's. Uh, they were considered, they're considered one of the forerunners of the alternative rock movement. Um, they were pretty well known for uh, Michael Stipe and his unusual lyrics, if you will, kind of dark lyrics, and also the guitar playing of Peter Buck. Uh, Peter Buck often played a Rickenbacker and he, uh, it's pretty clear from listening to him play that his influences included Roger McGuinn of the Birds. The one I love is one of those songs that I always thought was going to be difficult to play, but when I pulled out the guitar and actually started to play it, it's nowhere near as difficult as I thought it would be. Uh, it's in the key of E minor. You're also going to play a D sus2, which is simply a D lifting your second finger up. Okay, there's a G, a D, an A minor and a C in this song also. song starts is you're playing the E minor chord and then you're going to put your well it doesn't matter which finger you use I use my second finger on the G note on the e, low E string and you're going to slide up to the A and then you're going to play that D so it's and it takes a little practice to hit that correctly I hope you can't hear the dishwasher in the background uh, my wife came in and turned the dishwasher on and left before I realized what was happening. So I can hear it here, so hopefully you can. This song uh, really only has two verses, uh, although in the third verse, one just one line is changed. And the second verse is the same as the first one. is the same chord pattern that starts with the line of simple prop to occupy my time. Have fun with it.